Hello everyone, Abhishek Shah, Stage 15 member, Staff and Staffer. Today I'll be doing this a beautiful bunting. Uh, I decided to do this as festival was around the corner and I wanted to make some decorations for my home. So this is what I have done. The team of Crafty Scrappers have designed some various uh, very beautiful uh, Dashera and uh, Diwali themed stamps. Uh, I received uh, these two stamp sets uh, in my BT kit this, this month. You can see how beautiful the, they have been designed. Very beautiful sentiments and various designs. Perfect for card makers and mixed media artists. Uh, so let's begin with the project. I have pre-cut these triangles. Uh, they measure about uh, 4 inches in width and uh, 3.5 inches in uh, height. I have just taken a 200 GSM white card stock and I've cut them up and uh, I've uh, joined two triangles to make it a little sturdy. You can take a thicker cardboard or any other material to do the same. I have uh, taken this uh, mini stencil. It's called as flower vines. It's from Crafty Scrappers. Uh, using some shimmer paste, I'll be doing some stenciling. I have taken the colors blush and lilac uh, to do my stenciling. The shimmer pairs are very very beautiful, they give you such beautiful texture. I will be doing the same uh, stenciling on all the five uh, triangles that have cut down. Uh, once I finished stenciling on all the five uh, triangles, I just let it air dry. It's completely dry now. And you can see how beautiful it looks, how uh, beautiful texture it gives you. The shimmer paste also gives you this beautiful shine. Uh, my camera is not able to catch it, but uh, visually when I see it, it's very, very pretty and very beautiful. It's time to make a few elements for my bunting. Uh, using this Deepavali stamp set, I chose the Diya and uh, I have stamped them and fuzzy cut them. Uh, next, I chose a few chipboards from my stash and I will be painting them. Uh, I have just covered everything first with white acrylic paint. And then to add some color, I have used the Lushy Orchid uh, Shimmer Spray. My chipboard is dry so it's time to stick all the elements together. I'm using the hot glue to stick all my elements. To stick my dia element, I'm using a foam tape. Uh, this would give a bit of a height and a dimension to the project.
and this is how it finally looks so thank you guys for stopping by and hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial